G'day everyone, it is the captain. Welcome back to the channel. A big thank you, of course, to each and every one of you that like and subscribe to these videos and you share them around the world with all of your buddies, all of your pals, and all of your mates. You are in for a treat today because we are looking at MAA audits. Who, by the way, seems to be in love with police because he just has to go out there and record their every move so he can go home and pull his eeny weeny peeny. So anyway, his mum's kicked him out of the basement because it's a lovely day in the neighbourhood. So he's headed out with his camera and thought, why not spoil this great day for everyone involved? Oh, by the way, his voice, just his voice alone should equal a EPA fine. This, this, this guy, is that is that, that guy's personal phone right there? Because if it is, I'm going to FOIA request it. Huh? Well, does he know he can't be... We're going to make some disorderly conduct the rest. I want you to get it. He can't be doing that shit, though. That's public records right now. Hey, I'm a citizen. I'm not a police officer. Hey, look at this, people. We got a smart ass here that doesn't know the law. No, he's a page. He just started being a punk to me. I clean this fucking property. Good, 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 good. See this, Karen? Oh, good. Yeah. Police are notorious. Notorious? Notorious? I don't even know what that word means. Notorious. That's the word I'm looking for. For letting people just go walking through their scene. Why not? Hey, while you're there, why don't you offer some legal advice as well? They love that. Ah, uh, you bloody sour snatch patch. What are we going to do with you? What goes through that wind tunnel of a brain where you think it's a great idea to go wandering through a scene like this? Uh, you're about as welcome as a llama during an alpaca orgy. Fuck me. The only warm organ in a dead dingo is this bloke's small penis. What a fucking son of a bitch. Y'all guys not helping on Saturday. We don't like it, man. We don't like it. With the no, you want promotion? There you go. No, I don't want you want to get promoted? I don't want promotion. Yeah. You want more money? Hey, you know that's personal personal records right now, right? Yes, I do, sir. Okay, so. No, it ain't. Yeah, I can. No, it ain't. No, you ain't. I'm not a cop. I'm not a police officer. What's your name? Why are you going to go? I don't answer questions, dude. You already know me. You could use people who already know me. Yeah. Hey, hey, out. see, I don't care about the camera, but that's probably, I'm going to FOIA request that. Yep. Don't delete nothing out of your phone. I'll, I'll, oh, it's, it's it's not your personal it's phone. Police phone. It's police property? Okay, okay I can still I can still FOIA request it. I, I'm already going to send it to Office 614. What's yours? What's your name? Royer, R-O-Y-E. Royer? Yep. First time I come across you. At least you ain't. At least you ain't an idiot like this guy across the street. Why won't you give me yours? Cause I don't have to. Okay. And you know it, and I know it. I love the Massachusetts accent, right? I love the Boston accent, right? I really do. But munching asshole anonymous here, his voice just makes me want to throat punch him so fucking bad. Ah, oh, you cocksucker! Why don't you go and get some Worcestershire sauce from that empty car park? I don't know if that's a good Boston accent or not, but I'm gonna fucking claim it that it is. Anyway, the only good thing about this guy is when he sucks on some pork swords is we get some peace and fucking quiet for 10 minutes. Yes, dipshit, the police have phones, right? That's how it works. They're allowed to fucking film too. Why are they not allowed to film and you are allowed to film? Are you the lord of the fucking cameras or something? That's right, that's the law. That's the law. And you don't have to give him your name unless he suspects you of a crime. Do you live here, sir? I don't answer questions, dude. Do you live here, sir? I don't answer questions. So you're here just to cause problems? I'm not causing nothing. I'm exercising my First Amendment right, my friend. That's a problem? So you got a problem with that. You got a problem with that. Huh? You hear this, people? He got a problem with me exercising my First Amendment right. He was speaking. He was speaking. Do you arrest somebody for picking? Mm -hmm. Is that a criminal offense? On private property, yes. No. What's private about it? 
trespassing. Frank, lower your voice. That's the city for a party. Lower your voice, Frank. Lower your voice. Why do you have to yell? Hey, where's the signs to no trespass? Is there any signs over there that says no trespassing? The city for a party is ours. Hey, you guys are getting them for trespassing, huh? Where's this? Where's the sign that says no trespassing? I don't see any anywhere. There's no signs that say no trespass. Okay, cool, awesome. Let's all head over to this chicken fucker of chaos's house, shall we? Right, or tent, or trailer, wherever the fuck he lives. Let's hang out with his penis airport of his sister. Why not, huh? And when she's finished with all of the fucking Red Sox team, we can all go on it together. What? There isn't any sign saying that she can only take one penis at a time, is there? Oh my god. Fucking God! Oh, because there isn't a sign doesn't make it fucking legal! Oh my fucking God! You know what comes after 69ing with his sister? Normally mouthwash and herpes. For fuck's sake, you window licker. You don't need a fucking sign for fucking every law on the planet. This bloke is too dumb to even be accepted into Scientology! Which is a shame because no one would give 10 fucks if he goes missing for 10 years! Oh, by the way, where is Shelly? David, where's Shelly? We all deserve to know. I don't see a sign anywhere that says no trespassing. No trespassing. Police take notice. There's the sign, people. So they got him for trespassing. Who are you? They got him. Huh? Who are you? Hey, you hear this? You hear this piece of shit? Disseminate my, my public information right here. What's your name, buddy? What's your name, pal? Joyce? Joyce? Like what? Smoke the Joyce? Huh? 683? Violation right there, you idiot. If you know me, why are you trying? Why are you violating my rights, you idiot? Huh? You just stole my freaking personal information to people, you asshole. You're giving my personal information out. You're violating my rights. You're a piece of shit. You're a piece of shit. Okay? Yeah, have a good day. Don't you wish you could slap the cuffs on me, huh? You piece of shit. You're a piece of shit. <laughs> Fuck you, you stupid snowflake. What argument do you have now, huh? None! There is a fucking sign! You're as fucked as prom night pussy! Look at you! Hey! Why are you so upset? There isn't a sign saying that the police can't give out your personal information, Randall! Is there? Hey! I bet! I fucking bet! That you sound like an old, almost dead German Shepherd having an asthma attack every time you pull your cock. You know? You're a piece of shit. I'm an example. Keep, keep saying my name. Say my last name again, asshole. Go ahead. Tell them. Tell them. Tell them. Go ahead. Violate me again. When you lose your freaking qualified immunity, asshole. This guy's a real piece of shit. See him disseminate my first and last name? Huh? Give him my personal information out? Huh? You see this cop give my personal information out? Ask him his badge number, all of them. I got him. I got his badge number. This motherfucker's getting a complaint right now. I'm going down to the police station. This piece of shit's getting a complaint, right? And then I'll go to the attorney general with your name because that's where I go. I go over your asshole head. You think you're all that because you got qualified immunity. You're a piece of shit. Okay? Matter of fact, I'm going to pull all your records and I'm going to post it all over YouTube for everybody to see, your family and everybody else, okay? You want to be a smart ass? Yeah. Oh, I ain't going nowhere, buddy. Okay? I didn't know we were allowed to give out personal information here on YouTube. Thanks very much, Randall. Have a look at you, mate. You look like a smash can of assholes. Honestly, if meth and heroin had a baby, it would be fucking you. Were you born with a rap sheet? Because you look like you were fucking born with a criminal record. Right, you didn't even get a birth certificate. You just got extra charges laid in. That's what fucking you look like, mate. I bet you you have the coordination of an octopus with a brain hemorrhage trying to unhook a bra. Uh, honestly, if you were a fucking animal at the zoo with a face like that, they would have put you out of your fucking misery by now. You look like 
like everybody that's ever been fucking pulled out of the East River in New York. That's what you fucking look like. Dead set. You're a fucked up looking zombie of a motherfucker. Look at you. Hey, keep this attitude going, big fella, and you will get to play our favorite game of Fuck Around and find out. Oh, you get a supervisor. He asked for a supervisor. You get him a supervisor. You get him. It's the fucking law, buddy. Do you know the law? You are an asshole. Hey, violation of city rights right here. Civil rights. This guy's a real piece of shit. This guy's a backup. So he's a piece of shit, too. Right? And this guy hasn't said a word, so I'm not going to say nothing against this guy. Hey, I'm not coming to you being angry. You gave me an attitude. You gave me an attitude. I was talking to you with respect. You gave me an attitude, and now you're getting it back. You don't like it, huh? I don't care. It's like if you put... Hey, it's just like... He just fucking disseminated my information in public. You asshole, you're, you're supposed play, to, you're supposed to, you're, you're supposed to protect, game, you're supposed to protect. And we still are, we still are. Yo, yo, hey, lie. you violated my rights, you idiot. He's a tyrant. He's a tyrant. He's a tyrant. Huh? City wall. Let's come on, let's show him around. This is, a, this is what happened. Hey. Public drinking. You see this guy right here? He's a great guy. You see this guy he's right here? Guy. See him? Give me the fist pump, because he's a cool yeah, dude. He's not a piece of shit like you and that other asshole right there. <laughs> I fucking love these cops. I really fucking do. We should buy a news agency together. We'll call it The Boys in Blue Bring the News to You. I fucking would be so excited to own a fucking news agency with you fellas. I fucking really would. They care so little about rabbit raping Randall here that he may as well be the vegan option at the Outback Steakhouse. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh, oh, speaking about love and mate, by the way, Elizabeth Banks came around for seconds today. Oh my god, she opened her piss pocket for my fucking spanner socket. Oh, it was wild. It was almost like a fucking plastic bag choking a dolphin. Huh? No, he's got um. Tell him that too. His mother made a raise. Uh, doesn't bother me, buddy. It doesn't bother me. No, I know because you got qualified immunity, right? But when you lose it, it'll bother you. What am I doing? Am I going here? You, you violate. He, you let your buddy violate my civil rights, and you're all for it. Are we doing anything wrong? Are you? You're all for it. I'll be honest with you. Are we being overly aggressive? We're not, right? We're not hurting. And I'm not out here for being over aggressive. Okay. He's not even touching him. He had him cut. Okay. Yes, it's got nothing to do with that. It's got nothing to do with that. He said his name and what, no, he said my he name, said, asshole. Cop. Like, he said my you? name. Know, he gave my personal you? information what out. Do do That's something you're supposed to protect by law, you idiot. Do you know the law? Because you don't know the law. You don't know the law, dude. You don't know the law, but you're a cop. Hang on a minute, hang on, hang on, hang on. Isn't the fraud of this catchphrase the whole there's no expectation of privacy in public? What whatever happened to that today? We just we just forget about that one today, shall we? Yeah, yeah, right, oh fuck face. Uh, how's your piss bitch in the background here, by the way, giving advice like he's some drunken father at fucking Pee Wee football. Oh, call his mum a bitch. Yeah, yeah, that will fucking show him. <laughs> I bet when he fucks street hookers, his ass claps together and it sounds like a fat guy running in flip flops. I can't fucking tell you. Keep pushing, dipshit. You know where this is headed. You know no shit. All you know how to do is slap cuffs on people. You know shit. I wish I did. What's the First I, I Amendment? What's the five steps Don't of the even First know how Amendment? I'm not my name, buddy. I'm retarded, huh? right? What am I, dumb? Okay. No. Yeah, you right. can't tell it, huh? Because yeah. you don't know the fucking One first plus five. One is 11. Huh? Oh, one plus one is 11. What an idiot. This guy's a real idiot. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Record all you want. It's fine. I am recording, dude. I am be on your ass like flies on shit in this piece of shit over here. In this piece of shit over here. Come on, say my first and last name again. Violate my rights some more. You know you're supposed to protect my privacy, and you go freaking spelling it out to the neighborhood, asshole. You're a fucking. You're a police officer, dickhead. You're supposed to protect my privacy, you piece of shit. You don't tell my last name to people. Wait, I don't care, but I'm telling you the law. And you're, you're, you'll be on the lawsuit, okay? Your name will be at the top of the lawsuit, you piece of shit. Okay, you want to you wanna address me by somebody? You call me good citizen, okay? And I'll address you by piece of shit, because that's what you are. 
Officer, no, Mrs. Piece of Shit. Go home and beat your boyfriend, okay? Or maybe your wife, you know what I mean? <laughs> that showed him. <laughs> Fucking burn. Oh, you unfuckable parakeet. All you need to do now is get him on the ropes with a couple of your, your mum is so fat jokes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That will send him back to the station crying. <laughs> uh, I love how these cops have just completely tuned him out too. You, you know how like some people can tune out, you know, like a screaming baby or Alanis Morissette? Fucking go home, big fella, before you wind up on the 10 o'clock news. Oh, that's her for. That's what you guys do. That's what you guys do. You got a badge, you got a gun, you think you're all that. You're a piece of shit. Do you think you're tough with the camera? You no, know? I don't think I'm tough with the camera. What is that? What are, you, what are you challenging me or something, dude? Huh? You think you're tough with a badge and a gun and cuffs and the authority to arrest somebody. Uh, did I you, arrest think you, you think did you're I arrest fucking anybody? bad. I think I'm bad with a camera because yeah, the camera's going to beat you up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a good guy. Stop. Well, tell him to shut the fuck up. Tell him to shut up. Tell him to shut up, okay? He's violated. This asshole violated my rights big time. Okay? He'll, he'll, he's, I'm going down to the police station right now on his ass. These cops don't like me, bro. You know, they don't like to be told the law. They think they're the law because they got a ga- gun and badge on. Not one of them can tell me the First Amendment, the, f- the five elements of the First Amendment. Not one of them. Because they're dumb. Thank you. Why, Randall? Yeah, ask this guy. Don't mess with me, dude. Because I'll be on your ass like flies on shit. I'll be on your ass like your boyfriend is when you go home at night. Hey, hey. You piece of shit. And then comes back up. There's a sign there, yeah? Yeah. Get it out of my face. Listen, you're allowed to record. Don't put it in my face. I think as a general rule, you shouldn't get into a cop's face like this unless, one, you want to give him a little bit of a kissy kissy, or two, you want your face smashed in like snails at a kid's birthday party in the garden. And it seems Randy Randall here has chosen to be the snail. This guy thinks he's smart. He really does think he is smart. He's about as smart as a parachute that only opens on impact. Uh, He hangs around these cops like flies do on those bloody Unicliff commercials. Cuff me, dude. Come on, you want want to? I know you do. Because I've been been talking shit to you. Come on, buddy. Do it. What did I do? You ain't doing shit, motherfucker. If you do it, it'll be illegally. Oh, yeah? Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Come up with something. Strim something. Take your glasses off. Let me see your eyes, you little pussy. You pussy. You don't enforce shit. Okay. Well, you you think you're the law. You think you enforce the law. You don't enforce shit, dude. You you bust people's asses is what you do. He's a big fucking loser, that guy right there. Why don't you go to Hollywood with your camera? Yeah. Go up to Hollywood with your witnesses. This is this is Hollywood, LA baby, low area. I'm not trying to make money, bro. I'm trying to I'm trying to show people their rights, man. <laughs> that's, that is the biggest piece of horseshit I've ever heard. <laughs> if that's the case, heroin addicted Mark Wahlberg, demonetize your channel, right? I think it's time, boys and girls, I really do think it's time to play our favorite game of fuck around and find out. <laughs> We're gonna put this in the history of Florida. Yeah, we call that shit. Yeah, we call that shit. Send it to WP. This is what you guys do. Take your phone out on these guys. Any violations of your civil rights? Randall. Yeah, tell them my last name. Go ahead. Gagnon. Gagnon. Randall Gagnon. There's another one. You guys, you guys think you guys are untouchable, huh? The Attorney General is gonna have a good time with you. I am. What the fuck can you do to me right now? Nothing. Because I didn't break the law. Yeah. Right now, okay? Disorderly conduct. Disorderly? In public. Like really? Do it. Do it, motherfucker. Consent. Okay. Thank you, Randall. Consent? You ain't touching me. You ain't touching me. And I'm resting. You ain't touching me for nothing. Hey, hold on. This guy's going to arrest me for a camera? Hold on. No. 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 You see this, people, right? No. Hold the camera. Ha, 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 ha. 
<laughs> what? What? What do people dare the cops to arrest them and then get really upset when they get arrested? It's like having a cry because the stripper showed you her back cave for men crave. Fuck me. <laughs> I enjoy hanging out with your new buddy in the back of the transport van there, big fella. Oh, my God. You can work out which one of you is going to be the big spoon on your way to jail, hey? That would be nice. That would be lovely. Oh, my lordy, lordy, lord. And I don't mean the New Zealand singer either. She doesn't return my text. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, that does bring us to the end of another great video. I hope that you've enjoyed yourself. I hope that you've had a good laugh, and I hope, really deep down inside myself, that you have either taken your shirt off or got naked, because that's what we do here on this channel. But I've got to get going. I am very, very tired. I've had a big day, because ever since they banned plastic straws, I've had to go out and strangle turtles with my bare hands. I tried to relax. I came home and I wanted to put on one of those adult, uh, adult channels, but I turned on the origami porn channel. Ah. It's only pay-per-view. It's ridiculous. I was going to try and tell you all a joke about my penis as well, but turned out it was way too long. So, you know, it is what it is. I've got to get going, though. I'm catching up with a mate of mine. He's actually a doctor. He works in the OBGYN uh, ward at the local hospital. He's asked me to team up with him for the day, and I'm going to spend the entire day getting my nose into other people's business. All right, that's it. Hooroo.